Hello, this is Nancy Marion, and I'm going to do a live video tour of 3401 Red Fox Road. Here's the front of the home. One of the great things about this neighborhood and area is this nice little lake back behind the blue house there that has a walking, biking trail that goes around the lake with a playground at the end. I've got some pictures of that online of information about the home. This home was built in 2013 by Tasteful Homes and there are some very signature aspects of this builder such as a front Thermatrue door. Thermatrue doors are high-end exterior doors. They have a triple pin locking system and you'll notice a particularly lovely glass design in the side lights and the window above the door. So Tasteful Homes is recognized as Ames Premier Builder and they do many many upgrades that older builders, other builders just don't do. For example instead of a main floor vault we've got actual raised ceilings more of a great room kind of concept. You'll notice crown moldings, lights and fans, lots of recessed lights, eyeball lights above this beautiful stone fireplace, and a lovely wood mantle and stone hearth. One other very signature aspect of this builder is the number of windows that you have throughout the home. These are high quality windows, oversized, and you'll also notice the transom windows above. This home backs to ground that is owned by Iowa State and this is another very unique and signature aspect of this home that you will not have anybody behind you You'll also notice when I'm outside that this is an extremely quiet area. We are the furthest removed from trains, students, and traffic. So if you want to have an area where your kids can get out and run around and play, this is it. So inside we have some very high-end lighting fixtures and you'll notice that there's granite tops, tile backsplash, and wood flooring all throughout the main floor here. It's a beautiful open concept. You'll notice lovely high-end trim work. Nice moldings above windows and panels below and a combination of painted and wood. So you can see in the living room here, we've got this lovely cherry finished wood above and below. In the kitchen, cherry finished cabinetry, and then an island that is done in black cabinetry. Stainless steel appliances, and a lovely uh, gas range that was quite an upgrade from the usual under cabinetry lighting and of course some lovely crown molding on the top of the cabinets. Wrought iron rails and as we walk over here into the laundry mudroom you can see a beautiful locker arrangement as well as a sink and counter tile floors of course. Stepping into the garage you'll notice a good sized three car garage and of course this has many upgrades as well. Windows in the doors, finished walls, and this builder typically does insulate the exterior garage walls which is not typically done. The design of this home is absolutely lovely. You'll notice 
wide base casing along the floors and wide uh, casing around doors. So there's a front hall coat closet and turning the corner here we enter into the master bedroom. A lovely arrangement with a big triple pane window, 10 foot ceilings, crown molding, lights and fans, sconce lighting, so many upgrades beyond the norm. Another signature of this builder is that they always put in these adjustable fan switches here as well as independent light switches for all the various lighting in every room. The master bedroom bath features a pocket door, tile flooring, and dual sinks uh, with extra counter and storage space. So you'll notice some tall vanities, bench and a little bit of storage there, additional windows, and again beautiful moldings in the ceiling area. The second portion of the bathroom has the toilet and a gorgeous walk-in tile shower. This tile shower was a significant upgrade. It features a body spray, a recessed area for your stuff, and an additional light fan option in here. Then we also have a nice walk-in closet to the right. So stepping through the home again, I'll show you the other bedroom bath. This home features two bedrooms and two baths on the main floor. This bathroom is very large, has a built-in linen closet, granite sinks and framed mirrors, and then a full tub shower, and yet another storage closet. The second main floor bedroom also has a tray ceiling, recessed lights, moldings. This room is very, very large. Features a double window and a very good walk-in closet. All the closets here are switched with lights. Again, another upgrade that you will not typically find Let's head down into the basement. The basement has 1349 square feet finished. The main floor of this home has 1529. It was built in 2013. That's a storage closet at the bottom of the stairs for utility and sump pump. We turn the corner and we see a lovely wet bar with under cabinetry lighting, lighting in the cabinets and room for 